right, guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video. So I did my uh, Yellow Coin LR tier list recently. Uh, Yellow Coin LR, funny enough, the list is mostly dominated by EZA characters, believe it or not. Um, I think a lot of, some, well, some of the Yellow Coin LR EZAs this year, I think have been very good. Um, I think this baby right here, obviously LR Goku Black. Beerus and Whis to me is kind of like, a little bit under the radar. I think that unit could be very effective, actually. Um, so we've gotten some decent yellow coin LR EZAs, which is good. God Goku as well. Let me not disrespect him. Which is good, because going into it, I feel like all these LR EZAs, I'm, like, laughing. Like, I, I don't know, kids. I think it's going to be pretty bad. So I, I'm glad that uh, a bunch of these units are actually fairly usable. Now, a lot of people um, had contention with me having the Spirit Bomb Goku above Baby. I mean, I, bro, you, you could put Baby above that Goku. It doesn't like it, it, it doesn't really change stuff too much. But I figured it would be a good time to uh, do some specific showcases for Baby in these Dismal Feature Red Zone fights, right? Like, it's a perfect time. This guy's not yet out on Global, so Global players will probably be interested in seeing this. Um, so we'll go ahead and jump in. Now, uh, one thing also it uh, is we have reached the Dark Ages for uh, Dokkan. So it's going to be very slow over the next month. Right? Like, people initially are going to be very hyped leading up the heroes, but, I mean, we'll see how good they're going to be. Um, and then, the other thing I was going to say is, my one problem with Baby, I think Baby is fine. Like, all of the stuff that he can do um, is pretty good. Right? Like, he, he actually has... Whereas, the in LR Spirit Bomb, Goku has nothing special he's doing. Baby actually does have quite a few strong abilities, such as Dodge and, of course, the Great Ape Transformation. But, the one main issue for Baby here is teams he's on a lot of categories but it's the weakness of big bad bosses by my estimation if we would say a top tier character you have tech fusion zamasu ejl fusion zamasu and i probably would only then put majunior as well so i think those are the only three where i would say are just like supremely top class characters like omega can do stuff in specific situations turles can do stuff in specific situations LR Metal Cooler can help you in specific. Same thing with this cooler. Like, Big Bad Boss is just not really in the best spot right now. But, I mean, that's shitty design for characters this year, right? So, I think Baby could struggle in these fights because it's like, you know, he's a solid option. But, you know, we don't really have, like, a killer here besides Piccolo Jr. Um, once AGL Zamasu transforms, of course, he's going to be able to do pretty good. But... Um, I do think we could encounter significant issue. Okay, baby in slot 7. That's annoying. I mean, are we even going to make it to slot 7? Let's see. We'll, we'll do our best here. Uh, this is not a particularly great opening rotation. Um, I mean, we're going to need... The, the good thing is that Zamasu, his heal will trigger at the end of the turn if we live. Uh, remember that Amon didn't raise, and I have them with a full dodge build. If they dodge anything, that does count as building up their passive, by the way. Amon and Raisin do not build up by being hit. They build up by guarding. So if they're in slot one, they can dodge. So they're a very obvious full dodge character, by the way. Um, okay, okay, sure. Additional, uh, normal, okay. So we got the hidden potential system additional right there. Uh, dodge it? No, we eat it. Okay, um... All right, well, there's the super attack, at least. So, here's the thing. Amon and Raze, we took a lot of damage. They'll be okay on the next turn. The problem here is I probably should have put Ejail Zamasu in the middle slot. I am uncertain on if Ejail Zamasu can tank here. I don't think he can, but we'll see. Um, our chances of winning are decent if we can make it out of here. I mean, remember, we have Piccolo Jr. and Baby, both who have Great Ape Transformations. So, we have three. Right, Piccolo Jr. being a, like Piccolo Jr. being as good as he is, like, and I think Tech Fusion Zamasu really to me is is quite outstanding. Like, that's it. That's all we've got for villains. EGL Zamasu is a very, very great EZA, but I mean, he could be touched. Uh, we want we're probably gonna need either an additional super or dodges here. One of the two, I think. We got the hidden potential system additional, but it's a normal. Thank you. Okay, that's good. Okay, well, uh, so, I mean, we died off of a hidden potential system additional normal, so that's good. I, I do, I love, like, we could actually see, like, oh, we got the hidden potential system additional, and then it was a 50-50 normal, so we died because of that. I love that. That's great. That's great. Okay, let's hop right back in. 
Sure. Um, all right, baby on the second turn. That is not... Yeah, baby is... Yes, okay. Um, I guess we could see baby really impact us positively here because we might take enough damage to where baby will immediately transform. And it's not one of these things where it's like, oh, no, we're wasting his, you know, transformation early or something like that. Like, no, no, no. Like, we want that shit out ASAP. That's good. That saves us health. We need that. Okay. What are you doing, fraud? 59? Okay. That's, I mean, that's not the worst ever. Yeah. Get those dodges in, fellas. Thank you. Thank you. I think my Amand and Raisin, they have nearly 30 dodge, I think. I should double check. If it's not higher, like, I, I should make it higher. Amand and Raisin, by the way, they, they've got to be the best banyan of the year, right? Them, oh, that's a great spot for a super attack. This is it's, this is double digits, I think. Close to it. I'll take that. I'll take that. Yeah, Mon and Raisin are very good. SDR Krillin, very good. Um, those, I mean, I am... People, I mean, people say I'm harsh for every character, but... Summonable units these days... Was that one by Majunior? Okay. Um, but I, I am very harsh. Like... I don't like the idea of some little units like, okay, well, if these 50 perfect conditions hit, we're okay. We're not going to get the gritty. Yeah. Puts us in a tough spot. Um, okay. Well, the good news here is this right here, right? Like, mm, I guess I should have floated my junior off last turn. Okay. Uh, we could be in trouble here. Because Majunior, he's not going to transform, right? Uh, he doesn't transform until turn four. All right, well, just hopefully one of the Majuniors does not get destroyed in kind of like the last spot. Remember, Majunior is not on planetary destruction. Well, uh, because it's Saiyan Saga Piccolo. Who destroys a planet? Not Piccolo Jr. Even, I mean, it is the same character, but it's before he did it. Um... Oh, boy. All right, this could do a lot of damage. So, Baby has an ability... Yeah, it's, a, it's up. Okay, okay, okay. That's good. That's that's one thing that is helpful for us. So, Baby has an ability, right? Which is, he gets 100% attack and defense and a 40% chance to crit when doing a super if HP is above 40%. If HP is... Okay, nice dodges, dickhead. If HP is 40% or... Wait, 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 wait were we... Damn it, I didn't see. And now HL Zamasu is going to get killed again, dude. Ah, nice dodge, Zamasu. God damn it. Well, I mean, again, th this is... <laughs> I mean, okay. I, 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 Right about now, I could say, like, you know, I, I mean, I'm not going crazy. Like, oh my god, in Spirit Pop, Goku could do so much. But, like, you know, we could run about Power Wishes and it could go pretty effectively, right? Like, running, like, my junior's team and it's just kind of like, eh, eh. You know, like, this is what I expected. I is there something that we could replace EGL Zamasu with? I just, like, want more strength right away. I mean, we could put the TUR EGL Golden Frieza. That character does take damage now, though. Like, that TUR Golden Frieza is not like, oh, you're taking zero damage, right? Like, uh, I don't know, man. Yeah, I think we'll keep... Bro, we are dying for Dokkan Fest, Lord Slug, God of the Game. All right, baby in rotation two. Okay. We got my Junior in slot seven again. All right. Let's... Oh, this rotation. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to lose next turn. We're going to have to... We're going to have to revive a Metal Cooler, I guess. Oh, wow. We, we got really bad rotations this time. I'm going to leave Amon and Raisin in slot 1. They, they'll obviously take more damage than Golden Frieza. Um, but they, they're they only guarding in slot 1. And that AoE would just do so, <laughs> so much damage. So, I, I feel more comfortable with them in that spot. Um, Okay, 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 okay. What are we going to do here? Well, Baby looks like we are going to get a great ape with him. We just barely live. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna... Oh, nice. Wonderful. <laughs> yeah. Very fair fight, by the way. It's very fair. Very fair. Very fair. Very fair. 
Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna get some good footage from Baby here. We're gonna move into this next phase. Baby, which one thing that is incredible of Baby, his grid ape condition is just grid ape under 40% HP, right? Uh, which is really nice because he had a 50% chance of transforming before his EZA. For his EZA, they took away the 50% chance, which is really good. Uh, now, I mean, I think it was... If I remember correctly, I mean, you guys could pull up, I guess, one of my older videos or go look on the wiki or something. I don't know. I remember Baby had a different condition, transformation condition, when he was first revealed. And then they changed it. And they changed it for the better. I think there was a turn... I think his HP pro like was higher, like it was like 50%, but it was like a there was a turn restriction or something like that on it too. That I believe that was when they first showed him off in the stream, but they changed it. Um, and I mean that has led to something good because now, you know, after his EZA, it's just fall below 40%. So that's pretty good for us. Okay. So, Majunior doing his thing, sure. Um, all right, so we did a decent amount of damage there. So, the main reason this is so good right here, remember, a Baby could do significant damage because this Great Ape here does have a high chance to crit, right? Yeah, high chance to crit and plus two key per key sphere. So, Baby could do some decent damage for us. Um, we're probably going to need the crits to do damage because, remember, Fusion Zamasu also has the, you know, zero damage. What I think it's if they do under 1.5 million, right? But ba what Baby is going to do is he's going to keep... Zamasu from being able to do his AoEs and do a super attack and stuff like that when we leave the Great Ape form. Yeah, zero. If, if we don't crit, we're twin zero. God damn it. Uh, but remember, even, even if Baby does zero crits here, we're still getting uh, nice value here because of getting rid of his abilities. Okay, sure. I'll take the damage. Two million damage. We'll take that. Um, and again, remember, Baby has a 50% chance to crit just from his... Um, Great Ape uh, passive right here. Alright, so... When the next turn starts, Metal Cooler is going to heal us by a little bit. Do we throw Metal Cooler out to have him try and revive? Is that our best bet? The problem is Metal Cooler... I mean, to say that he gets demolished... By physical Zamasu is a bit of an understatement. Physical Zamasu gets ab, ab, just turned into silly putty, turned into a, a charred skeleton, right? So I would prefer to save Metal Cooler Survive till physical Zamasu. Let's see what this next turn looks like. We know AJL Zamasu, I mean, until he transforms, like, he cannot take the punishment too much. Um, I mean, it, it's so sad. We actually died off of Hidden Potential System Additional Normal Men. I love it. I, c I complain about it so much, and then it does kill us. Thank you. Thank you so much, Additional Normals. Okay. <laughs> nice dodging. Yeah, dodging, it does nothing. Okay, sure. Whatever. All right, we're still, we're still in baby mode. So this is turn three right here. Beautiful. Uh, we'll hit this. Um, I guess I could give that... So we have a bunch of physical key lined up for Metal Cooler. And a bunch of AGL key potentially lined up for Baby if I want to go that route. We'll, again, we'll see. I gotta... I, I think there's a very good chance we're gonna leave this. And we're just gonna die to normal attacks anyway. Because AGL Zamasu is just not strong enough until he transforms. Um, I would like to think of a nice replacement. But I'm not even... I mean, Majunior, I don't want to say that his team is, like, the worst ever. But what if we brought Ribri? Could we bring Ribri in? What if we brought LR Ribri in? We could, because, I mean, Piccolo Jr. leads Giant, right? He leads Giant, Gift of Warriors, and Terrifying Conquerors, so. I kind of kind of like the idea. I mean, maybe we just throw Orange Pickle on the team? He wouldn't have his intro, though, which means he could struggle. I guess I, I I guess we could try and do this, bro. I I think AGL Tomasu is gonna need to dodge. He's gonna need to dodge or additional one of the two. So my build here, we got twenty one additional twelve dodge. To me, I, I feel like this has worked well. I have gotten some clutch additional supers with this character before, um, and I have gotten clutch dodges dodges that have saved me before. So I do like the combo there. Um, Baby, by the way, we do of course have him with full dodge. Uh, his value in base is is dodging right remember if he gives himself a crit chance by himself if your hp is above 40 percent when he supers and then of course if you're um going up against saiyans he has a, a, a much higher stats 
So, alright. Uh, I'm gonna just go... If Metal metal Cooler's heal, I think, lost us the fight. Like, if Metal Cooler didn't heal at the start of turn, we'd be good. Because I could just put Metal Cooler so I won, he would die. If I... Ah, uh, damn. I, don't, I really don't know what to do here. I... We could... Because, uh, damn, I... Metal Cooler is going to take a little damage, but the damage will quickly lower. I don't... I don't think Metal Cooler will die in Sot 1. Like, he'll take damage, but we have too much health. So we're at two... Let, 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 let's check. Let's see if Metal Cooler takes more than 215k. Let's see. Alright. They do link up fairly well. I mean, we have... Uh, um. Thirst for Conquest and Big Bad Bosses, right? Like that that that's a that's a lot of stats. Just these two links is a lot of stats right here. There's 15% attack and defense, and then of course Big Bad Boss is 25% attack and defense. So it's a huge amount of stats from two links. Uh again, EJL is gonna either need to double super or dodge for us. Oh, he took Oh no. Ah, damn, okay. We actually would have died. Alright, well, that sucks. Okay, okay, okay. He actually he actually would have died if I didn't get the same type orbs. God damn it. Um Alright, but we're still left to EJL Zamasu needs to additional or dodge. I if we didn't get the same type orbs, Metal Cooler would have died and we would have revived, revived with full health. Baby is not gonna take damage. We don't have to worry about him, but again, it's it's EJL Zamasu. One of two things. Additional super or dodge. Baby did no dodging there, dude. What the hell? Oh, God. All three deaths are HL Zamasu, right? Like, oh my God. Ay, ay, ay. Metal Cooler is so bad, dude. I actually thought... I thought he'd be able to, to hang in there a little bit better than he did. Bro, we gotta... I gotta take... I gotta find someone for... HL Samasu blows ass right now. Like, he he's died every run. Yeah, dude. I, I, like, I, I'm, I'm looking... Dude, there's nothing... There's nothing safe that we can bring here. Nothing. There, there actually is no safe option. It's like we could toy around with some stuff like EGLT or Golden Frieza. I mean, we could try Baby Janemba. I, I mean, we could rock Orange Piccolo, and if we get extreme luck, it could work out. But remember, no Bond of Master and Disciple ally on the team, so he would not be able to trigger his um, intro, which he would have type disadvantage right away against the monster, which would be tough. I, I'm really tempted to try Ribby, but I, I mean, bro, this. God, I, I guess I guess we'll just we'll just we'll just run it back. We'll just run it back with Ajil's amount too. Um Okay. Okay, okay. Well, this was a fun video. Um <laughs> Okay, dude. Sure. Uh, not, dude, that this is this is loading into death right here. That's what this is called. Alrighty. Well, I mean, miracles could happen. They do happen every day. We can five dodge this. Nope. I mean, there's not. There's no counterplay to that besides hidden potential system dodge. None. Right? Like, it's just a terrible opening rotation. Piccolo Jr. has one weakness. He can't go in slot one, typically. Very, very, very rare and few situations where you put Piccolo Jr. in slot one. And Baby is not a slot one. I mean, but Baby. I mean, Baby is a yellow Quinn LR easy, so I'm not like, oh my god, he's trash because he's not a slot one. It's like, no, I mean, he's not a summonable character. Uh, all right, we're going to lose again. Great. Incredible, incredible, incredible. Yep, so, I mean, I'm not really like, oh my god, guys, I made some giganto mistake with Baby. I don't think so. Like, he he was positioned fine. You're going to slide him above Spirit Bomb Goku, sure, but, like, it's not... All right, let's um, let's just get Zamasu in front of the, the least amount of resistance. What are the chances that's a super attack right there? Zamasu, just four out of five deaths. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I don't want to float baby off for the showcase, but like, let's do our best to try and win here. And I, I think just putting Zamasu in front of the least amount of resistance is what we do want to do. Oh my god, our second rotation. Yeah, we're just screwed. This is bullshit. Trash. 
And remember, all these other characters um, we can run on Baby seem cooler, Turles, Ginyu. They're all losers. They're all terrible at this point. Like, it's just, it is what it is. Time moves on, you know, mem back in the, oh my god, LR Cooler is so good. Even I, I'm not the biggest offensive unit guy, but like, you know, the day he came out, it's like, um, he is that guy, right? Like, it's, that is a real thing. But, it ain't 2022 anymore, man, so... Yo, know, these characters, a lot of them just aren't good enough. Uh, we're okay. Because remember, Baby gets a lot of extra defense. Um, and he's got, you know, all, all the dodge chance stuff like that. We're good, we're good, we're good. Um, so, last turn. Dude, we have... Oh. God damn it, we're losing to the heels, man. Okay, so 100% Metal Cooler is not dying. <laughs> it's over! I can't... I cannot put... I guess we could. Because the first attack is the AoE, so we could put Piccolo Jr. in slot one. I mean, do we do that? I, this is a gamble, but, like, what what am I supposed to do? Like, we need Big Bad Bosses up for these Piccolo Juniors, dude. Like, holy Christ. I mean, it's, you know, the game just hates me. All right, just kill me. Get me out of here. Go ahead. That's where he supers? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, my God. Just like, uh, co just comedy. I'm not, a I'm not a fan of the setups that we have to use with Baby. I am sitting here every month praying, please give us better villains. This is the result of we have no good villains. It gets very, 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 very sticky. I mean, we saw, I feel like Baby himself was looking pretty good though, right? Like, I mean, he had the, the nice turn of the great ape and stuff, but I mean, for the most part, I mean, things were iffy. Um... Yeah, I mean, that last rotation, I, I just wasn't comfortable with the other Majunia not having Big Bad Bosses activated. I mean, you, we load into this fight, and you get double Majunia the same turn, you've lost, right? It's over. GG. So, I mean, it's, it's tough. It's tough. It's tough. Tough to uh, do this fight with shitty teams, and this is a shitty team. Um, Baby, I mean, Baby at least was fairly solid, though, for sure, for sure, for sure.